Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's tutorial, we are focused now in Microsoft Word, how to create a five pieces wall art canvas. Let's get started. If you are not yet subscriber of my channel, please don't forget to click subscribe and click the notification bell so that you will be notified for our new videos in our channel. Now, previously in our past video, I featured already how to create a five pieces wall art in using our PowerPoint. Now, today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to do it also in Microsoft Word. So let's get started. So to start with, go to your start button, click the word document or Microsoft Word. I am using Word 2016. Click that one and then choose the blank document. Okay. So to begin with, our layout now is in portrait mode. So we will go to the layout, click layout. And then after you click the layout, click the orientation to landscape. So we will change our orientation into landscape mode. Okay. So our paper size, this is in letter. You can also use A4. So it's up to you for your uh, preference on what paper you are going to use or commonly use in your, in your place. So I am using A4. Now the next part is we will go to insert and we will add shape. So square, click, and then we will draw a, a shape here first one okay and then after that we will duplicate this shape into uh, another one so right click copy and then right click paste okay so you have one more copy or you can if you have your shortcut you can just click ctrl c in your keyboard and then ctrl v and you have now the copy of the shape that you are going to copy now Next, you are going to make it smaller a little bit and then arrange in the proper place. And then after that, you need to copy to the opposite side. So right click, copy, right click, copy, right click, paste, paste, okay, in the source formatting, not a picture. Remember, source formatting or if you want to be safe, you just use your keyboard shortcut again, control C. Control V on your keyboard and you have another one. Now remember, you have the lines. The green line shows that this is in the center. Then after that, on this side again, you need to copy again. Right click copy or Control C. Right click paste or Control V on your keyboard and then put that one on the other side. Okay, and then after that, you make it smaller again. And then adjust it in the center. Okay, so it's up to you, your preference on what is the size of your shapes. But usually, it's randomly decreasing until the end uh, uh, shape. So again, we need to copy this one, Control V, Control C, and then move it on the other side. So if you can see now, your shape now is complete. We have five shapes randomly decreasing till the end of our shapes so after that all you need to do is to click the first one hold control in your keyboard hold control click 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 and click so you need to say you choose all the shapes okay by clicking control and after that next we will go to arrange and here in the arrange okay under the format arrange we can see group so you need to group this one into one so if you group this one into one, meaning this object now is in one group. So even if you click the, the first one, it's in one group. Next, next step is to fill this one with a picture. So previously, if you are watching in my previous tutorial, the PowerPoint, I am selecting a car, right, in uh, putting a picture here. So for example, Go to uh, right click and you can see fill and you have a picture or 
you can go here to shape fill and you have also your pictures the same now when you click fill you have an option of from a file maybe you have pic pictures from your travel so you save that one in your computer so you can use that one you browse and look for that file in your computer but if not you can use also the online pictures okay so for example i will be choosing city scape and then enter so you have different pictures here now you it's up to you to choose okay for example i will be choosing this one okay for for an example only so you can see now uh, the cityscape is in our five pieces wall art then after you choose your picture all you need to do is to right click again and go to format object line and then we will change this one to four okay you can see the line now is four points then the next part is we will add shadow shadow uh, also black and you can see you have the, the shadow here the next part is on this background we will add another shape so go to insert again insert shape then we will add shape that fit on the a4 size of paper click and then after that right click bring or send it to back send to back and then we will fill this one to gradient so click this shape go to fill and then we will add gradient now in this gradient this time we will be using the type will be radial and then we will change the color to gray and then remove this one again add lighter gray and this one will be white color so if you can see, we need to have a regional color like this. If you want to make it darker, just move the arrow like that. So if you can see, we complete now our five pieces wall art using now Word document. If you want, if you are a fan of using a PowerPoint document, uh, just go to the PowerPoint tutorial in the previous video. Uh, I will pin this one also in this video. And you can you can use also PowerPoint in creating this one. You can you can add any design and any pictures. And after that one, you can save and you can print it. Okay, so that's all for today. Hope you learned something in our tutorial. You can enhance your work based on your preference. And again, this is Debbie June 101. Thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe, to like, and share it with your friends. And see you again for the next Microsoft Word tutorial. Have a nice day, everyone, and God bless.